Kellyanne Conway casually sits, and etiquette arbiters take a stand. During President Trump's meeting with dozens of leaders of historically black universities on Monday, Kellyanne Conway, the White House counselor, made herself at home in the Oval Office. She hopped onto a couch, sat back on her heels and tapped on her phone. This impromptu manner of sitting is common in living rooms across America, but not in the Oval Office. And there are more important things underway in the White House, an ambitious budget, health care, it's complicated, and a presidential address to Congress on Tuesday. But Miss Conway's posture was all the kindling a hair-triggered public needed to ignite a battle over decorum. For those watching closely, and millions are, this seemed like the latest flouting of protocol by an administration that has showed a penchant for spontaneity and a willingness to ignore unwritten rules of White House life. When Mr. Trump invited Justin Trudeau, the Canadian Prime Minister, into the Oval Office in early February, his daughter Anka, normally considered the most polished member of the family, was criticized for taking an impromptu seat at her father's desk. On the other end of the spectrum, Stephen K. Bannon, the president's chief strategist, has been targeted for dressing too casually. And the first lady does not yet live in Washington. But Miss Conway's willingness to sit casually on a couch seemed a step too far. To Pamela Ayering, president of the Protocol School of Washington, whose programs focus on etiquette, it just looked a lot like a rookie protocol mistake. Miss Ayering said the photos of Miss Conway probably negate the whatever message of unity Mr. Trump was trying to project. The whole media opportunity to show the goodwill and the collaboration showing what the president is trying to do is gone now, Miss Ayering said. Let the media take the shot instead of you trying to stand on furniture. On Twitter, people categorized the episode as an outrage, an opportunity for laughs or an overblown controversy. Liberals are losing their mind because Kelly Ann Conway is kneeling on a couch and not treating furniture with respect, wrote Jack Murphy, who posts extensively on Twitter about the president. He then shared nine photos of former President Barack Obama with his feet propped up on desks and chairs in the White House. View image on Twitter.